All right, so I um, made two new journals. I know that most of you know that I really love peacocks, and for some reason I just had, had not made a peacock journal to sell, so I thought that would be the next ones that I did. These two are almost identical, so I just put a little tag that says one and two so you can tell the difference. And the size of these are approximately seven by five and a quarter. And they're pretty chunky, so they're about two and a quarter. I got a little crazy. I just kept stuffing pages in there, and then I I put in the um, signatures. And then once I was done, I realized I had like over two hundred and some pages in there. So I just stopped, and I go, "Oh my goodness!" You know, now I don't have any room to put anything in them extra. Um, but that's your job. You are supposed to make the inside pretty. I make the outside pretty. You put the inside stuff together to make it pretty. All right. What I did on these, um, I had some ledger paper that was given to me from 1925. And so that is the background here, is that ledger paper. And then on top of that, I did some encaustic medium over it. And then I put the feathers and then put the encaustic medium over that. And these, obviously, as you can tell, they're hard covers. Then on the sides, I had some canvas that I put. And then on the back, I had some really cool peacock material that I put in the back. I usually don't make... Um, what do you call it? <laughs> Charms for my uh, journals, but I just I just felt like it this time. So it has this charm, and um, I have some peacocks on here. Then I have some different um, strings and material, and then I have a few beads. It's on this kind of a clip in case you're not you know a kind of person that likes to have. All this, um, you know, noise and stuff on the side. I personally don't use these, but I know a lot of people like them. So I thought I would include it. You can always put it in the front or put it on another journal or, you know, whatever it is that your little heart desires. So both of those have one of these and they are um, the same. They are the same. Okay. One and two. Alrighty. So, I'll just do a quick flip. See? Okay. So, what I've done inside is I've incorporated um, the tabs made out of the fabric and some little sparklies here and there and some of my echo printed papers and my cleanup papers from my echo printed and so on and so forth pretty much um, what you're used to seeing in my journals alrighty so like I said there are <laughs> too many oh some ledger paper too there is just uh, so many pages in here I kind of overdid it. Like I said, there's over 200. So there is plenty of room for you guys to, you know, make this your journal and do whatever it is you want to do in it. But I had a lot of fun collecting the papers and sewing in some of the fabric and sparklies in there. I always enjoy doing that. Oopsie. Mm -hmm. I made a little tag for you. Some more little 
sparkies. And here is um, some of the Echo dyed and some more there with a little tag. And this is an envelope, also echo dyed. And another little envelope with some echo dyeing on it. I don't know if you can hear it, but all the little birds outside, they've been hatching the past few days. And you can hear them when their mommy comes to feed them. I love to hear that. But they're all over early spring, I guess. Which is good for my echo dime because I got weeds going up. I've been doing a lot of my printing because I have a lot of new uh, plants out there. Weeds, flowers, all kinds of fun stuff to print. I printed some the other day and I posted it. Me not knowing what they were, I called them weeds. And then I was informed they were chamomile. <laughs> A lot I know. Oh, dear. So, I guess after I boil, I have some tea, right? <laughs> Along with a lot of pulp from the paper, so I guess I won't be drinking that anytime soon. Ta-da! Okay. So that is, that is number one. Identical. <laughs> I used, you know, the same papers. A few little different fabrics. That's about it. But for the most part. They are the same. Another envelope. And cord. Oops. I think I'll make a video of my new batch of Echo Dine because the colors are different. They're getting unique. As the seasons change, you know, we're going to be getting different things to dye. So, a nice variety. So, I'll be incorporating those new ones in future journals. I love these little things. See there, if you fold them, those are little index cards. I think they're so cute. No, little file folders, excuse me. I just have them folded up. Let's see if you guys want to. You can do what you like. So if you like the chunky ones, this one is for you. <laughs> wow. 
We're almost there. If you are interested, this is number two. I'm not sure what difference that makes. <laughs> and this one is number one. Alrighty! I hope they find a new home, and I hope it's with you.